we are seeing the very first concrete at Tesla Giga Berlin, the beginning of something very big. We see the construction workers laying the first concrete at Giga Berlin. This is something really big and Tesla Giga Berlin is entering a new phase, a decisive phase of building Tesla's first European Gigafactory. Tesla Giga Berlin Foundation work begins ahead of the groundbreaking ceremony and I have two videos sharing with you thanks to our friend Jürgen from Grünheide that show close-up view of how this groundbreaking and detailed work is going forward. This is entering a very exciting phase friends because yesterday we also learned that tesla hired the max bogel company to do the groundbreaking work and uh, things are moving forward right now with full speed welcome back friends this is armin harian from torquenews.com if you are here please subscribe for the if you are here for the first time please subscribe to our channel join our community and let's get started last week Tesla received all the necessary permissions to start groundbreaking, so the construction crew got to work. The German construction company Max Bogel is excavating a quarry for the plant factory plant Giga Berlin of the California automaker Tesla. Last Wednesday, the State Environmental Protection Agency approved the start of foundation work on the site and as uh, this video show from the drones has already achieved significant success we see that tesla has achieved significant success i'm particularly interested in the sandboxes i looked online and to see what the sandboxes are used for but if any one of you is in construction business let us know what are these sandboxes used for there wasn't much written because everybody was referring on software sandboxes which we know what they are so uh, uh, tesla the american company has come a long way in preparing for the construction of the of the plant of this giga plant giga, giga berlin which is tesla's first european giga factory by the way speaking of the european giga factory if you remember uh, seven uh, to about three four days ago i reported news based on the uk publication uk top publication that the united state united kingdom's government is also looking for a big land for tesla to consider a gigafactory in united in the united kingdom uh, so having cleared back to gig back to giga berlin having cleared the site of 90 hectares of pine plantation <clears throat> clearing the roots and topsoil tesla is now embarking on the construction phase this is a very exciting phase the main contractor works farther and farther inland down to the groundwater and the company received all the necessary permission from the authorities to dig all the way until it reaches the groundwater the durability and high quality of the foundation is incredibly important a factory is a high-tech standard and a very heavy building this requires completely different installation conditions than for example a residential building or a shopping center according to assumptions from uh, toby lind our friend tobias who has been sending us uh, giga berlin images and videos every every day tesla is currently working on the area that is um, uh, that uh, that is actually highlighted in this image that I will show you uh, as you see in in these images that go around earlier in this uh, place stress tests were carried out on May 19 the pile dri uh, driver began work and placed 19 piles uh, on the ground on May 26 the piles were prepared for a load test this must be done in order to make sure that the land in this area is stable and ready for foundation work also the test results will show the condition of the soil so that in the future this uh, does not cause a problem after construction of the structure initial uh, land tests on piles is performed to confirm the design load calculations it's important to confirm the design's load calculations and to provide guidelines for setting up the limits of acceptance for routine tests. It also gives an idea of the uh, sustainability of the piling system. Initial tests on piles are to be carried out uh, at one or more locations depending on the number of piles required. The test loads shall be maintained for 24 hours and then they will know how much load and how much heavy weight 
the piles can hold. The entire Tesla community and investors uh, are eagerly watching the progress at the Giga Berlin. At the moment, all work is going according to plan, so there is every reason to believe that the first deliveries of the uh, made in Germany Tesla Model Y will be coming off the assembly line in 2021. I think sometimes in July of 2021. If you are interested, if you are a Tesla investor or Tesla enthusiast or interested in Giga Berlin, please subscribe to our channel because if you look in our channel, we have Giga Berlin reports almost daily, on some days even uh, two reports. And uh, in the meantime, this is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. Friends, if you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel. Like this video to show your appreciation of our friends Jürgen, Tobias and Albrecht who have been sending us Giga Berlin reports daily and helping Torque News YouTube channel to chronicle Giga Berlin daily on this channel. And um, stay safe. God bless you. Love one another and take good care of each other, friends. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you in our next report today.